Welcome back 40 Pinus and thanks for watching. So, as you're probably aware, our brews are made up of around 95% water. You may have heard me say in earlier videos that if your tap water doesn't taste chlorine, you're okay to brew with it. As much as this advice is good, it's not the best advice if you want to improve your brew's flavours. The reason is that most water companies use chlorine or chloramines to make our water safe to drink, which is obviously good for drinking, but not so much for home brewing. But there is a solution. It's primarily used in winemaking, but home brewers have been using it too. If you haven't heard of it, it's the trusty Camden tablet. Camden tablets have multiple uses, including treating juices and must for winemaking, as a sterilising solution for the equipment, and for our purpose, removing chlorine and chloramines from our water. So, you're going to need a spare 23 litre fermenter bucket, a pair of washing up gloves, a bowl and two spoons, a 3 litre plastic jug, and an 18 inch brewing spoon. The Camden tablets, obviously, and a pill cutter, or you could use a sharp knife. Just make sure everything is clean and sanitised before proceeding. So, fill your fermenter with 10 litres of tap water. Cut one Camden tablet in half, as we'll only be needing half of one. Crush your half of Camden tablet between your two spoons. Put it into a bowl and fully dissolve it in some warm water. Then tip it into your fermenter, giving it a good stir. Then top up with another 10 litres of tap water, making 20 litres in total. Stir until it's all dissolved. The Camden tablet works immediately at removing chlorine and chloramines, but to be safe, leave it for a few minutes. Then you can use your three litre jug to add to your beer as needed. Thanks again for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for future videos. Also don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Stay safe everyone.